Hello everyone, myself Dr. Aditya Gupta, uh, currently pursuing my DM in Pediatric Oncology from Ames Delhi and having done my MD in Pediatrics from Ames. So in this video, I wanted to talk to anyone who's going to appear for this NEED PG counselling. Uh, finally, the counselling has started. Thank God. Uh, thank God to, uh, you know, uh, you at NMC for finally starting the NEED PG counselling. But uh, let's deciding upon your college for Pediatrics. So unlike, uh, I have made a, a video with Rishabh discussing the best college for radiology. For unlike radiology, a field which is very, very much dependent upon uh, uh, the kind of instruments that you're dealing with pediatrics let me be very being be, being very very honest with you uh, as far as knee pg colleges are concerned is uh, especially the state's best medical college is concerned uh, the level of pediatrics the level of uh, variety of cases you'll see will almost be similar until and unless you're literally in the central institute because that's where the facility suddenly expand so until and unless you are literally in the central institute like an Ames Delhi or PGI Chandigarh or JIPMA rest of the state medical colleges more or less will be similar so the criteria for choosing a college are different rather than oh how good is their academics because most of the time is similar uh, so my simple funda is that you should always uh, uh, pick a college which has no bond or minimal bond rather than a college which has bond simply because it limits and bonds uh, your future uh, so if you are doing let's say MD in pediatrics and you want to come to Ames Delhi for SR ship a simple SR ship uh, if you have a bond you probably won't be able to join right and uh, even if you want to come to let's say Ames Delhi or uh, uh, PGI or Jipmar or want to pursue your DM the bond will be an impediment in order to do that so it's always better to choose a place which has less amount of like a less uh, duration of bond uh, or no bond preferably now amongst no bond uh, colleges I say that Delhi colleges are slightly better in that particular regard because the culture of DM the uh, the you know the mindset that you have to do a DM is slightly more in Delhi colleges so that is and uh, departments are also segregated specialization wise as far as Delhi colleges are concerned so Delhi colleges uh, are equal to any college which is uh, having a no bond but slightly preference a personal bias you might say uh, that Delhi colleges and it's reflected in the, the choices that uh, need PG aspirants also take the Delhi colleges are preferred over other peripheral colleges even with the who ha have similar amount of bond as far as pediatrics is concerned I've told about this in my previous video DM is semi necessary so uh, choosing a college which has a culture of DM or you know pe people cracking DM obviously is going to help because you're, your seniors can guide you how they're prepared for the NEET SS and sort of that sort. So you choosing a college of pediatrics, choose a central institute, Ames Delhi, PGI, JIPMA, followed by a college in Delhi or a college which has no bond, followed by a college which has bond. There are certain caveats to this, which I'll say that if two colleges have similar bond, let's say one college has no bond, another college has one one year bond, then obviously it's better to choose a college which is closer to your home. So I let's say I uh, someone is from you know Hyderabad or someone is from uh, you know Andhra Pradesh or Telangana. Uh, it's always and you're thinking that hey maybe Mumbai colleges are better and Osmania is you know uh, maybe not that good. It's not like that. Choose Osmania or let's say you're getting Andhra Medical College for that matter. Choose Andhra Medical College. Residency is a tough period. It's better to stay home rather moving to a different place with different culture and different language so choose a college which has lower amount of bond and if two colleges have similar bond like zero year or one year or one year one year then choose a college which is closer to your home and if you have two if you're not you're definitely moving away from your own home you're someone from Jharkhand or Bihar and you're going to definitely move to a different city altogether you, you're not want to pursue your post graduation in a college in Bihar or Jharkhand uh, then prefer metros over second tier town so an example again would be let's say you're getting your uh, degree you are getting to do your MB, uh, your MD from let's say a uh, Jaipur versus let's say from some other Ajmer or something on those lines and obviously it's pre preferable that you do it from Jaipur rather than Ajmer or you do it from a better in, uh, institute with no bond rather than doing it from institute from a bond. Now uh, from as far as Delhi colleges are concerned I can easily help you guide that that uh, MAMC and LH are the best colleges both of them in my opinion are equivalent. Uh, LH is a more pediatric associated college while MAMC has more specialization in some way. MAMC is slightly more toxic, LH is slightly less toxic. So it's my opinion that MAMC and LH are similar. Again, RML is equivalent. RML is not as, doesn't have that much of a, you know, a fame associated with it. It's not as old, but RML is a really, really good college, which you should not leave if you're getting it. So MAMC and LH, in my opinion, are now equivalent to RML because RML also has a lot of super specialization that has come up as a central institute. And one of the few reasons that I really like RML from what I've uh, uh, known from my colleagues is that RML's toxicity is lesser as compared to other Delhi colleges and they are better than Safdarjung Hospital and UCMS and a similar trend is followed as far as medicine also is concerned. So in my opinion actually RML actually has beaten MAMC and LHMC because of the toxicity profile of it that is slightly less toxic uh, 
my colleagues would have heard it has a better work environment as compared to let's say MAMC and LHMC. So choosing a M college for MD pediatrics should be really really simple. Choose a college with no bond versus a college with bond. If you're getting similar bond, choose closer to your home because residency is a tough time. It's better to stay closer to home rather than moving away from home. And amongst no bond colleges, I'll say preferable to choose a Delhi college because Delhi colleges have that culture of DM. And DM is sort of semi-necessary as far as MD after MD pediatrics is concerned. It's not very necessary, but if you want to do it, it's better to do it from a Delhi college because that culture will imbibe and you will you who are seniors who would have cracked need SS pediatrics, they would be able to guide you better. And of course, if you're getting a central institute, then preferably take a central institute. If you get through the November INI, great. Take Ames Delhi, take, uh, take PJ Chandigarh, or take Chipma. Uh, another thing, I will be link, putting a link in the description and in the comment section. Uh, so I know that DM in pediatrics is uh, like, you know, a lot of people ask me, how do you clear DM in pediatrics and everything? So, uh, uh, and what are the previous year questions and everything? So I have a set of previous year papers and questions of Ames uh, SR ship. So if you want to come to Ames Delhi for SR ship, these questions have been sort of been passed on. So I just wanted to, you know, uh, like, you know, uh, they probably will be available on apps for like thousand or two thousand or like you know thousands of rupees so you can actually rather take it from here I'm charging a minimal amount uh, but uh, because otherwise no one is going to value them uh, but you can have a look at those questions that can be asked in your SR ship or DM entrance examination so thank you and have a nice day I hope it helped I would also like you to watch a similar video made by Divya Divya actually went more deeper into this uh, deeper into this uh, you know how to choose a college for pediatrics and her video is also a great uh, you know uh, way in order to decide your college as far as MD pediatrics is concerned thank you and have a nice day